My name is David Morris. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Max Trombley. And I'm Tina Verdasta. I'm Max. Hi, I'm Stacy. I'm Tina. I'm David. And we're both Le Boudoir. <laughs> I'm Tina, owner of Beausoleil Boudoir, and I'm going to be with you at every session, every step of the way. I'm your girl and I've got you. I got involved with Boudoir years ago as a hair and makeup artist working with a team in Baton Rouge. And during that time, I fell in love with it. I loved helping them build their business, asking all the questions leading up and kind of like helping with the sale I felt like in the beginning. And then they left. And I was sad, and it was my creative outlet. And so there was nobody in Louisiana doing the style of boudoir that I wanted to do. So I said, let's just do this, and created my own company. I'm David, I'm the, one of the photographers of Beau Soleil Boudoir, and I have been working with the company for nine years. I got involved with boudoir because Tina wanted to start a boudoir company, and she knew that I was good at photography, so she asked me if I would do one session, which turned out to be three, and it turned out really good, apparently. And she wouldn't let me stop. I have worked in the boudoir industry for five years for several different studios, and I did a lot, a lot of research before I decided uh, the next studio that I wanted to work for. And I love, love, love the whole one day experience that we have here. We have a full service studio that offers everything, client closet, wardrobe help, posing help, um, amazing photographers. We have three photographers, no one else does that. I shoot boudoir because I never felt pretty until my first boudoir session. I never thought I was photogenic, and to this day my friends kind of like poke at me because I have two modes. I have like, silly, goofy, here's my picture, and then I have like, hi, I have a boudoir face, <laughs> and I've got two modes, and that's it. And so I started shooting boudoir so other people could feel pretty and see themselves in a beautiful light that I didn't see till I did my first session. Well, the first time was because I was told that I'd be good at it and I needed the validation. After that, it was because once I realized, oh, you're actually pretty good at it, everybody who walked away from it felt like they'd never felt before, like they felt beautiful, or they felt confident, or they felt bold. And now I recognize the value in being able to provide that to people. I make clients comfortable having done this myself, being on the other side of the camera, having been in a place where I wasn't sure if I was gonna look or feel good and doing it. I make people comfortable by being an idiot. That's, that's basically my charm, is that I'm incredibly self-deprecating, obviously, and that I focus intently on making sure people have fun and are comfortable and feel like they are in a safe space. The art of making a client comfortable really comes down to being easy, you know, being easy and comfortable with what we do. You know, when a client walks in just saying, hey, I've got you, we've got you. You know, taking the taboo out of the nature of the work is the key piece. It's just, this is what we do and it's what we're fluent in, the creation of beautiful, sensual artwork. So letting the client feel that uh, when they walk in the door is the number one way. I just love working for this company. We're all very positive, we're all very happy people, and I tell clients all the time that we're just New Orleans. You're not gonna be nervous when we get here, when you get here. We're all just very happy New Orleans kind of people. David brings the charm. He brings levity, and he brings making you feel so comfortable about yourself. Even if you feel a little bit awkward, he's gonna be right there with you. And we have clients that just relate to him so much from being like the biggest dork and teddy bear and so bashful and sweet that they just like adore him because he truly does bring out the best things about our clients and then makes them feel so comfortable and confident in themselves. Whenever I am in a session and I've you know heard the vision that our clients want, I go, how do I bring that to life? Looking at their storyboards, looking at their, you know, questionnaires, and I go, okay, how do I make this work? And then, you know, we have our conversations when they're getting ready about, you know, the thing that they like about themselves the most, the thing that they want to express, and I go, okay, how do I build the right experience? How do I build the right image? How do I build the right look? And then 
you know, working together with our clients, with Tina, we managed to just deliver. It's sort of a wonderful thing that just sort of happens whenever we're all working together. And then the fact that I'm obsessed with making people laugh. It's just a thing that I can't stop doing. And so, you know, they get levity, they get enthusiasm, they get comfort, and then at the end of the day, they get beauty. You know, the thing that's great about Beausoleil is the team. And just speaking about the team, David is an artist of impeccable style. And the thing that always blows my mind is when I see his images, they uplift me and I'm like, ah, oh, they're so good. So you have incredible artistry, you know, from David. And with Tina, I mean, you just have a bombshell of joy, sensuality, and just you're like your number one cheerleader, aside from Stacy, of course. I love being their best friend. So people call me the boudoir bestie because I am. I walk them through the whole experience. I make sure that we have the wardrobe that we, they need. I go shopping with them online if they need me to. I'm available for any question they can possibly think of. They know I have them and I just love being their best friend and making sure that, you know, we get what they want. During the session, you know, Tina just brings this energy of ease and lightness. She shows you what to do and you can really relate to her because as, you know, a feminine being, you know, just her own experience and transmitting ease and possibility is just the, it's the most beautiful thing to witness and it's a joy to work with. I have done sessions over the last 15 years at different ages and weights and sizes and I have felt beautiful and I think you should do it so that you can feel beautiful and you can see yourself the way that other people see you and you know maybe see how good that ass looks and you should do this so when you're 70 you can look back and be like grandma was hot and those are the fun things that people don't think about like the empowerment I love and feeling beautiful, yes, but the fun stuff about it, like looking back and feeling confident, like those are really important and I think you should do it because of that. Her enthusiasm for boudoir as an art, as a craft, as an entity, I mean, she's done more sessions than anyone I know, which gives her experience both empathetically as the person in front of the camera and then her like drive and passion for it as a creative person behind the camera I think helps cultivate a great product. When the guys set up a shot I'm gonna see it not only as a beautiful picture but as how I want to feel as a woman. So I'm gonna make minute adjustments to a pose to make you feel even better. So it might just be like a hand, it might be an elbow, it might be to remind you, you know, lift up. Those are the things that I'm gonna bring to it so that it's not just an all around beautiful photo, but a really beautiful photo of you specifically. Max has an unbeatable amount of experience and then his, you know, similar enthusiasm for it lets him just see the thing that he wants. What Max brings to Beausoleil is incredible experience, making women feel not just like sexy, but hot. And he can, you know, have you move and see how the light just like lays on your body. I love when he talks about how light like lays over the body like water. The thing that sets us apart is that our approaches are all very different. Max's approach is from experience, passion, Tina is also experienced in passion, but from the complete and other side. And mine is because my experience was sculpted from scratch from both of them. I learned in the field, I learned in the sessions, I grew up in this industry doing. So all of it is hands-on experience and learning as I shot how to combine my over a decade of experience in another photography industry and how to use it to cultivate the perfect product and how to cultivate the perfect experience. What I hope you understand is that we have been working together for over a decade and we've worked with people of all ages, shapes, and sizes and no matter who walks in our door, we can create beauty. We can create an experience of sensuality and we can create beautiful images that you will be proud of no matter how you think you feel right now we will deliver on exactly what you desire. You will never forget the first time you see the new you, and that is what I want you to remember from this experience. I want you to feel like you don't want to put pants on when you leave. I want you to feel so good about yourself that you are like, I don't even need clothes. I am a goddess, I am a badass, I am fabulous. 
I want you to walk out on cloud nine and keep that confidence with you and know how much of a badass you are.